Hi, everybody. Welcome back to Pittsburgh Today Live. You know, Pittsburgh has really become a foodie destination. There are so many places to try out there. That's why I really like coming to spots like Federal Galley, where we are live at this morning, because you can try so many different concepts and so many different dishes under one roof. And if you are a chef out there, if you are dreaming of maybe opening your own restaurant, this is actually the best place for you to get started. I want to introduce you to Chef Wally. It smells so good back here in your kitchen, Chef. Tell me why this is such a different and unique concept for people out there wanting to get started. Aloha. Aloha. <laughs> Welcome. I'm so glad you can make it here today. So the galley uh, is providing tremendous opportunity for our upcoming chefs who want the opportunity to realize their concept to uh, to actually uh, open the restaurant one day. So this is a great startup uh, that minimal upfront costs and maximize their brand exposure. Absolutely, that's the best part about it. I know the Galley Group has been doing this concept for a while with several spots around the city and throughout the country. Why would this be so good for a chef to come to you to apply? Like, how does that process work if they're watching this right now? How do they get that started? So to get started, uh, you can get more information at galleygroup.com. And when you're ready, make sure you have your resume, your sample menu, and you can email that to press at galley.group.com. So okay. group at GRP, galleygrp.com. Now, if you are not a chef like myself, although I'm a wannabe chef, if you are just coming here to eat, it's such a gorgeous space. You have indoor space here, a beautiful outdoor courtyard. But when you're sitting here at the table, right now you have a few different options in here. I know they switch out with new chefs every so often. What do you have right now, and what's some of the food we have in front of us? So right now you get a little sample of Hawaiian food. So so here we start off with the Spam Musubi. Spam. I love Spam. Yeah, it is so good. <laughs> and then the next is the uh, truffle poke. It's make out ahi tuna. Oh, delicious. Uh, it's very fresh. And then this is a uh, very uh, kid-friendly dish is the huli huli chicken. It's a Hawaiian version of teriyaki the chicken. The huli huli chicken? Yes. What a great name. So when you come in here, you can go up to each restaurant if you wanted to place an order or this is what I like the best you can just scan this QR code you could order from your seat and you have a beautiful bar here so they could order their cocktails right from this code too right yes yes everything on the barcode if you you can just sit at the table drinks food they all coming out to the table oh, that's for so you. fantastic mm -hmm. well there is one that I have been waiting for all morning David and Heather the ramen. So I gotta take a bite real quick before we wrap, Chef. What is this that I'm digging into? This is our uh, house made miso ramen. Oh, it's wow. vegetarian. It have gourmet mushroom on there, tofu, and perfectly cooked ramen. This looks amazing. Chef, thank you so much for having us this morning. And of course, we'll have the details for you guys up on our website. If you are looking to apply to become a chef here, it's a great way to get started. Heather, do you remember, actually, Heather and David, both of you, you may have interviewed him at the same time. Chef Ryan Peters. Yeah. He actually started out in one of these kitchens. Right, yeah, right. Ironborn Pizza. Yes. And of now course, he's a yeah. huge TikTok star. Right. Yep, making us pasta yeah, everywhere. Yeah, and I was lucky to share the same platform at Dump. That's mm -hmm. wonderful. It's really it's so it good. Is. All right. Well, enjoy, Selena. We love it, and we love this idea because yeah. it really does provide a, a place for growth. Well, for and the yeah. confidence you're able to build up exactly. too. So I love that, and I yeah. love that she mentioned Ryan too. It's it's always great to see him. And There's see a him success succeed. story. Well, if you or someone you know would like to apply or learn more about all of this, visit our website, PittsburghTodayLive.com.